Hey, Dan Chouinard here again with EF Block and Earth Friendly Building Materials. We got a video for you today. It's really, really cool. We're out in Real Verde. Uh, Real Verde is, uh, if you guys don't know, you take dynamite, you head east, you go up over the hill and drop down by the Verde River. And we've got about 20 projects out here. Matter of fact, someday I'm just going to run around and shoot all the dang houses we build out here. But for right now, check out this video of the Real Verde Project, 152nd Street and Dynamite. There's the access holes there. We're only grounding this five foot today. It's a pretty big project. We want to get some mud in the walls before, uh, before the wind comes and blows it over. So I'm supposed to have some wet wind, uh, some wet windy weather this weekend. It's Friday afternoon. This is one week. Uh, with um, two guys today we had two more guys helping getting ready for the grout just have a couple extra people to hump the hose and make sure you're covered in case you have a blowout we don't have many blowouts but if you do have one you want to make sure you got enough help to get it taken care of and get the mud in the wall but really really a nice clean job you can see those windowsills leaning there they got the paint on one end, that uh, tells you which way they go. And then the uh, uh, we'll come back later. Well, we, we nail those in with uh, ring shank nails. And then when that grout goes in, that grout will go around that ring shank and keep that bucking on there. That's the, uh, the first bucking. Uh, we'll put a two by four secondary bucking on there and then we'll use a nail on window and flash it just like you would a stick frame project. Again, this is out in real verde. Beautiful out here. You can see four peaks in the distance over there. Yeah, just waiting on the inspection now. Got this all up. It's all 10 foot. That right there is 12 eight and then there's some 14 four. And then that's 15 foot nine, the dining room there. But it's all up, ready to go. Shorty's putting the columns out back for the glue lamp beam that's going to go on. Twenty-two yards. This is the first truck here. Got the garage all done here. All the way topped off. Alan's putting the bolts in now. Hey, that was pretty incredible, wasn't it? Well, that's just the first video. We're gonna follow this project through, and like I said, sometime I'm gonna run out here and just shoot a whole bunch of these completed projects. But most importantly, remember you can always go to efblock.com, check out our new website, and most, most, most importantly, Remember, recycle, reuse, and repurpose. Thank you for your time.